Hello and welcome to HP Calx. I'm Rick and today we're going to have a quick look at the TI-36X Pro Scientific Calculator. This is a new one I just picked up and it's uh, pretty cool. So we're going to look at how to do exponents on here. To do this we'll be using the X squared key, looks like this, located here. The X exponent or X power key looks like this, located here. And the negative key that looks like this and it's located down here. For the basics, if we just want a square number, like let's say 5 squared, all we have to do is place 5 on the screen and then press the x squared key, like that. You can see we have a 2 in the exponent position now, and we press enter, and we have 5 squared equals 25. If we want to find an exponent that isn't a 2, we can use the x box, x power, x exponent key, the one that looks like this, that's this one right here. So, for example, let's say we want to cube 5, or 5 to the power of 3. We would go 5 exponent 3. You can see we now have a 3 in the top there. And press enter. And we have 125. We can also use this to solve negative exponents. So let's say we wanted to find 5 to the power of negative 2. We press 5 the exponent key, and then we can use the negative, and then 2. You can see we now have a negative exponent there. Press enter, and you can see we get a result of 1 over 25. Now this calculator likes to give us fractions, but we can easily convert this back to a decimal with this key here, with the two arrows going left and right. Press that once, and you can see 1 over 25 is converted to 0 0.04, which is correct. Alright, I hope this helps, and good luck on those tests out there, everybody.